So, I'm Phil Lama and this is World Box. If you've been paying attention to the movie news or whatever, Napoleon movie's coming out and that's gonna be awesome. The story is so interesting to me. So, as a celebration, I'm making a Napoleon episode. Why not? Uh, so, the objective here will be if France gets conquered, the episode is over. Make sense? So, it will only exist until France doesn't exist anymore. And to be honest, whoever made this map made them a little bit weak 600 and it just takes 500 from the uk or 500 from the from spain to kind of destroy them kind of so i'm not sure how this will go uh, i think he also made um yeah he, he made napoleon and he isn't tiny good job i'm gonna make him uh super health though i want to i want to have him for a long time just pause let me heal him a bit i'm not the one who made this Obviously, I'm gonna put the name of whoever made this in the screen now. So this guy or girl did it. So thank you for that. I think he also named everyone else. Let me see. Portugal. What the fuck is this? Oh yeah, probably died. Just like that, that other guy died. But yeah, Spain as Ferdinand. Uh, the UK have George. Yeah, George. So yeah, I think, I think it's kind of accurate. Uh, he also made uh, an alliance, I think. Let me see. Alliance list Ottoman Empire, so Ottoman Empire, Egypt, Libya, Tunisia, and Algeria. So he made all of these the same thing, which is correct, I think. Russia is massive though, 1,600. Rip Poland, <laughs> for sure. <laughs> okay, let's just speed this up and see what happens. For some reason, the Prince of Piedmont is here in France? Why? Okay, I think France is putting all their soldiers next to Piedmont. That's probably not good for them. And why? Why is the prince of the, of them here? That doesn't sound good. Okay, Sweden attacked Denmark. Did, did Denmark have Norway back then? Not sure. But yeah, Sweden is, is going to destroy Denmark for sure. Only two hundred. There's no chance for them, even though they have they have Iceland. Also, I don't know if you noticed, Finland and Sweden should be blurred out. <laughs> They're too phallic for 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 YouTube. So yeah, Sweden destroyed Denmark. No chance at all. Maybe they will survive through through Iceland. It's a shame they don't have Greenland. Everyone else kind of uh, chilling. Austrian Empire is starting to think about war. So is England. Oh, can you imagine if they fought France? That would be funny. I mean, I doubt it. They, they are lower than them. Would that be smart? I'm not sure. Holy Roman Empire is starting a war as well. And so is France. Oh, this is gonna be good. Come on, Portugal, do something. Fight Spain or something. Or conquer Morocco. That's, that's your hobby. Or fail to conquer Morocco, I guess. <laughs> so the UK is far fighting the Austrian Empire for some reason. They're so far away. What's the point? And so is France? Really? Yeah, everyone is fighting the Austrian Empire for no reason. What did they do? <laughs> I think Ottoman Empire is going to go as well. So th this guy is just going to get absorbed. The Russian Empire is destroying Poland, by the way. I didn't even notice. They, they don't have a chance. Look at that. Just like I predicted at the start. There's no chance for Poland. Why is it that Poland always gets destroyed in every war? So I think Ottoman Empire is going for the Austrian Empire as well. These guys are getting gangbanged. Russia is still surviving with nine. <laughs> I don't know why Prussia isn't part of the Holy Roman Empire, to be honest. I'm not sure the timeline if it's correct, but I would assume they, they were still part of the Holy Roman Empire. Venice is, fight, is gonna fight someone. Can you even do anything with 88? Chill, bro. The Papa States are being aggressive. Look at that. They conquered whatever was be below them, but they are getting destroyed by Piedmont. So Piedmont is kind of united to Italy, only needing Nap Napoli and Venice, I suppose. France conquered the uh, uh, Netherlands and Belgium. Russia is massive. Look at that. And so is Ottoman Empire. I still can't believe Switzerland manages to survive every war they do nothing they're just here chilling having fun even with 18 people they're just here untouched by the the greed of war russia survived austrian empire didn't <laughs> oh no spain conquered portugal i didn't realize fuck oh you motherfuckers france it's up to you destroy spain so for some reason morocco is fighting pressure you don't even have eye contact with them oh Shit, Russian Empire is fighting France. Oh, this is gonna be good. I think France is fucked, and I think this is probably the end of the video. Because almost 2,000... Yeah, 2,000 people. 
they already conquered the part of Prussia that was in, well, that, that France had, or I guess Poland. But France has no chance. There's too many people. So the only way for France to survive this is if someone else gangs up on Russia. Holy Roman Empire declared war on Switzerland. Oh no, boys, they are neutral. Don't fight them. Well, Switzerland is gone, probably. Oh, everyone is fighting France. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, rip France. The UK is fighting France. Uh, who else? Yeah, everyone. I just see arrows everywhere pointing at France. So many people. But the UK is getting smashed, isn't it? Everyone is taking advantage of the fact that France is getting annihilated by Russia. Yeah, there's no chance now. France 280. Oh, everyone is destroying it. Where, where's... Wait, 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 wait. Where's uh, Napoleon? Where's our boy? Why? What? What is he doing here? Fighting alone? Oh no. Look at him. Public execution by everyone. Oh, the war ended? The war ended! He's still alive though! Oh, he's part of the UK! Or no? No, Russian Empire! Oh no, Napoleon is part of the Russian Empire now! Oh, we're fucked! Napoleon is still alive! This is the turn of events that I wasn't expecting. So he's still alive. His one eye is crippled. Almost dead. But he's here. The boy is here, 127 years old. Napoleon defected France. He's now the high high standing general of the Russian Empire. Napoleon, what have you done, bruv? Where's your national pride? So it was all a, a ruse. He, ex he, he planned it all. He planned the war with Russia just so he could be the general of the strongest country in the world at the moment. Or in Europe, at least. Napoleon, I can't believe you. So, no words at the moment. Sweden finally conquered Denmark. Sweden is massive at the moment. The UK is okay. The Ottoman Empire is huge. If they actually go all of them against Russia, this is gonna be cool as hell. And Prussia, look at them. Amazing. Ottoman Empire is gonna fight someone. Chill. Leave Prussia alone. They've been, they've been through enough. The UK is fighting someone, and Spain is fighting someone, or going to. We're gonna try Morocco. Oh, this is the jewel of Africa that, for some reason, Iberia has been real fond of. And this has been fucking us up every, every single time. It's actually one of the reasons why Portugal is so, pro so poor now. Because we put so much effort into invading Morocco that we got fucked in the ass. Well, we never recovered. <laughs> Yeah, Spain is trying to invade Morocco. I think they will do it. They're actually going around. Look at this. So th this massive army is going around the whole continent. Is it? Oh, the Ottomans are fighting Russia. Where's our boy? Our boy Napoleon. We're going to do nothing. Oh, he's fighting, he's fighting. He has killed 20, 21 people now. 22. Oh, he's a warrior. Who is he fighting though? Big clashes in the east. Uh... I think Ottoman Empire will conquer everything, let's be honest, they are massive. Holy Roman Empire is fighting Sweden, they're also fighting the UK, Morocco and Spain is done. Wait, Morocco, where is Morocco? Oh, Morocco is here, okay, Morocco conquered a bit of Prussia for some reason, but Prussia is still alive. They're still here, they moved a long way, but they're still here. Oh shit, Russian Empire is getting fucked, I think we have a new superpower. And where is our boy? Did it change again? He's on the Ottoman Empire now. I can't believe this. <laughs> I honestly can't believe this. Why little shit? He, he betrayed the Russian Empire again. He made them fight the Ottoman Empire because he knew. He knew of the potential of the Ottomans. So, thanks to Napoleon, Ottoman Empire is now the leading country. They are going to conquer everything. He, he, may, he planned everything so he could be on the strongest empire again. Oh, this motherfucker. Where is he? And is he the prince? This sly little shit. 144 years old. He is wise. Look at him. He knows. He knows what he's done. I'm going to fast forward because I think the Ottoman Empire pretty much won the game. You know, Spain is pretty huge now, a thousand. They're slowly become really strong. So Russia is done for. For some reason, Spain 
has a little bit of Finland. I don't know what happened there, but they, they went there. They also have a bit of uh, whatever is he was here. I think the Austrian Empire or the Holy Roman Empire. I'm not sure. Ottoman Empire is invading someone else, probably. Yeah, declared war on Sweden. So the, the second strongest military in the world at the moment. This is pretty much over. Fucking Napoleon. Yeah, no chance. Sweden, look at Sweden. So I think this is over. Okay, this will go on for a long time probably, so I guess let's end it here. And this motherfucker is still alive, so look at him. Almost 200 years old, killed, killed 31 people, but he won the war. He did what he had to do. For some reason, Prussia is still here, by the way. <laughs> In the middle of the Ottoman Empire with almost 6,000 people. But yeah. Thank you very much, I hope you enjoy this. Uh, very unexpected to see... Napoleon betray France for Russia and then betray Russia for the Ottoman Empire. But it is what it is. He's a, he's a genius, not me. So he knows what he was doing. And clearly he succeeded. He's living in, in his peace now. He's re in his retirement. Everyone loves him. Look at how many people surround him. Everyone loves him. Hope you enjoyed this. Like and subscribe and see you soon.